Hi, fishy folks, and happy Terrific Tuesday. That's right, another Tuesday video coming at you. Why? Because I can't wait to show you what I got at the Bucks County Aquarium Society auction that I went to on Saturday. It was a nine-hour auction extravaganza. I had a great time. I hung out with uh, Susie from NJ Betta Hatchery, and then I hung out with Scott and Liz, the king and queen of cichlids, and Lisa, of course, from super cichlids and alan and karen who just know a poop ton about all things fish mostly cichlids but they're just super smart people and awesome to hang out with i met some fans i met some uh really great people and it's it was just a great time nine hours i was there i didn't even buy that much i sold a lot not as much as i wanted to but i sold a lot so do you want to see what I got at the Bucks County Aquarium Society auction? So in this tank behind that Java moss, and actually there's one, I got some baby bristlenose plecos. I think there's four or five in here. Uh, there's one on the tube for the sponge filter. Gonna grow these out. Um, they're supposed to have a long fin gene, I think. I think these were Karen's. Karen, remind me what these are, cause I forgot. I think they're just calicos with the long fin gene. Anyway, they're awesome, and they were Karens, so I had to buy them. Um, in here we have some albino quarries. I didn't actually buy these at the auction. I bought them to sell at the auction, but there were like 160 bags of albino quarries, and mine were the smallest, and mine weren't auctioned, weren't going to be auctioned until probably hour eight, so I just took them back because I don't want to give them away. I kind of like them. I'm going to keep them and grow them out. What else did we get at the auction? Uh, oh, some more baby bristlenose. Here's some albinos. These guys aren't eating as much as I want. I forgot they're little tiny. You can see them one underneath the cholo wood, and there's another head sticking out right, right there. Little tiny guys. I think there's four of them in here. Um, funny thing, guys. I bought some guppies to sell, um, some red, white, and blue American guppies that I'm going to be breeding out, but I bought an extra trio to sell at the auction, and I put them in this tank uh, just for a couple days to hold them, and then I was pretty sure I took out all the guppies and put them in their own tank, and the other day I come down here and I see fry, lots of fry, and I'm like... Oh, the pink panda platies had fry, but they're so... S Wait a minute, those are guppy fry. That's right, I left a female in here by accident. She's probably underneath the, the sponge filter. That's where she's been hiding. Um, but there's got to be 30 fry in here. Well, there was 30 fry. I don't know how many are left in here, but... Uh, yeah, so bonus fry on this terrific Tuesday. Oh, there's the female. You can see her underneath the, uh, the drain. All right. In this tank, I got some half black blue guppies. Of course, I haven't seen them since I, that's not true. If I move everything around, I can find them. Uh, but they're hiding. Uh, there's the male. Let's see if he'll come out. Come out and say hi, buddy. Come here. Good guppy. You're a good guppy. Bye guppy. Half black blue. Uh, got them from Sherry. Uh, she's the something with the south jersey guppy club she has great guppies um i actually didn't even know they were hers until i bought them because uh i wasn't planning on buying anything so i didn't really look at all the lots in the auction what else did we get as far as fish i think i don't know i think that's it oh wait a minute i got a king tiger pleco l333 lumpy dog there he is in focus um I gotta get him some more hiding spots in here. I just wanted to put him in this 75 gallon because uh, I want him to grow. I want him to grow and I wanna see, I wanna be able to see him. So I gotta add some hiding spots. I think that'll make him a little bit more comfortable. But, and of course we got some goldfish. You've seen the goldfish. The other thing, things, cause I got a couple, as many as I could were um, those big sponge filters. I got a, like three or more of those love the sponge the box filters not sponge filters box filters which it's not even shaped like a box it's shaped like a cylinder do we call it a cylinder filter no 
we call it a box filter even though it's shaped like a cylinder and they are the old school and very simple but super effective um and so especially in the big tanks i'm just going to be swapping out all the the sponges for box filters and use the sponges for guppy tanks and fry tanks and uh, maybe tanks with little pleco so they can uh, eat off the sponge if they need to um let me see what else <coughs> excuse me oh that's right i got this spectacular betta that's for sale and i will show you look at this guy oh my god is he spectacular look at him look at him half moon no uh crown tail let me see if i can put him up here that's right we're gonna put him up here then we're gonna go this way so you can see him crown tail betta tangerine and black he can be yours for 50 dollars, including shipping people look at him Send me an email if you want them. I'll send you a PayPal invoice. Boom, he could be yours. Nice one, right? Right? We should name him. No, see, if I name him, I'm going to want to keep him. And I really want to sell him. So I'm trying to put this down. I can't put it down without spilling water. I spilled water. All right, folks. Got some more box filters. These corner guys. They came with this super magnet from uh 1927 but it's really strong it's really heavy uh yeah so that's what i got at the auction i didn't really buy a whole lot um the king tiger was was pretty uh pr i'm pretty happy with um let's look at some some black moscow fry there's about one two three five hundred in there i mean i think there's two drops probably of about 20 or 25 each and they're growing nice growing very nice um overall at the auction i did okay as far as selling goes i didn't certain things went for more than i thought they were going to go for but many of my guppies went for much less than what i sell them for which is okay it's a fundraiser it's a fun time but i think next year my plan is to only going to bring my plan is to only gonna bring is that even english my plan will be to only bring two or three strains and hopefully maximize the dollars of those strains and then i'll bring other stuff uh, like i did this year more plecos and more quarries and maybe some other some other oddball stuff so uh it was a great time like i said and i'm gonna do it again because i really liked it and I wish this guy would move around, but he's just chilling. So, all right, fishy folks. Hope everyone has a great, terrific Tuesday. Let me know in the comments below if you like this Tuesday video. I might continue to do them. And uh, hope you guys have a spectacular day. Good morning, fishy folks, and happy, terrific Tuesday. I'm going to try some Tuesday videos, I think, for a while. See how it goes. Let me know if you like Tuesday videos in the comments below. Hopefully, I'm going to do Tuesday and Wednesday and Friday and Sunday videos. Not sure. We'll see. Let's take a look of what I got at the auction, shall we? Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Terrific Tuesday yes that's right another tuesday video why i don't know i haven't really thought about it good morning fishy folks and happy terrific tuesday yes that's right another tuesday video why because i want to show you what i got at the auction on saturday i went to the bucks county aquarium society auction and there's a video that you can link somewhere in this area maybe here or just up here Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Terrific Tuesday. That's right, another Tuesday video coming at you. I want to show you what I got at the Bucks County Aquarium Society auction, my favorite auction. Uh... Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Terrific Tuesday. That's right, another Tuesday video coming at you. Why? because I can't wait to show you what I got at the Bucks County Aquarium Society auction that I went to on Saturday. 
uh, you can find a link to that video in the description below and I hope you take a look I had a great time I hung out with Scott and Liz from the King and Queens of King and Queens she's not Queens Hiya, fishy folks, and welcome to Terrific Tuesday. That's right, another Tuesday video coming at you. Why? Because I can't not tell you that I don't speak English correctly. Hiya, fishy folks, and welcome to a Terrific Tuesday video. That's right, another Tuesday. I will show you. In this tank, if I can... That's my belly. That wasn't the tank. 